uh, technical difficulties with the wings. <laughs> Let's just say they had an accident. <laughs> George, I guess we're eating sand today. Hey everybody, Joel Hansen here today with my good friend George Lobianco. Hey and today we're in Niagara Falls, New York at the Niagara Power Game, which is the baseball team of the Niagara University. And today we're here to do eat some chicken wings before their game. So it's a two minute contest. We have, I think, 25 wings or something. Winner gets a $100 gift card. Me and George are hoping we get it. And yeah. we're gonna go to the Anchor Bar, which is sponsoring this event, and blow that money. So let's see what can happen and let's eat some wings. Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. So as you can tell, this was a very small contest. Again, this was just kind of a really fun idea, opening up a university a baseball team game. So originally they had planned to give us 25 wings each, but as you saw, somebody might have dropped the wings. So there's less than 25 available per person. So what they did is they just basically said, whoever eats the most, they're gonna count bones. So that's exactly basically what we did. I started off with the drumsticks or the drums, thinking that they would be easier. However, they were kind of dry. They all appeared to kind of be sitting on top of the, like the rest of the wings for some reason. So then I went to the flats, which are a lot uh, moister and went from there. So with that everybody, hope you enjoy. That's just a little bit of, bit of background. So again, whoever can eat the most in two minutes and I'll let you get to the rest of the video. One minute left. for me, 16 for George, Um, we did get a hundred dollar gift card to Anchor Bar for winning, which is sweet. The wings were actually really, really good. Uh, I started on the drums or whatever you want to call them, and then I found they were a lot harder to eat. They seemed like drier, whereas the splits were moister, so I went to the splits then because those were just flying off. Um, so now we're actually going to go to the Anchor Bar and let's go have some fun. All right, and we made it to the Anchor Bar. This is the Niagara Falls location. It's not the original location, but nonetheless, the food will be great. Uh, here again with George and George, the Lo Biancos. There's also a little bit of a car show going on over there. So maybe we'll get to check that out after. That's what they're playing music for, all the old yeah, and cars sports cars. Many, many miles. There you go. So let's head on in, let's eat some food, and uh, let's just try the Anchor Bar. I've never been before. All right, so here we are. We got some uh, buffalo wings. Got some jerk wings, this is a dry rub. George got a buffalo barbecue, barbecue bacon burger. I got a buffalo wing burger. It has a buffalo wing on it. And for some reason they sent it out plain, so I'm gonna get some stuff for it. I got everything. And then George Sr. 
not the same thing I did. Oh, and I can't believe it. I was able to get a burger that was medium and not like well done. America. Buffalo wings not bad, not too much sauce on it. Try a jerk wing. Yeah, I cooked the shit out of it. Yeah, it's Jerk wings are like burnt. Char, char broil, char broil burger. Yeah, that's super good. Just bring out like a big side of it. Alright, thanks. But the burger is definitely cooked medium. I see pink. Pink. America. Increasing my chance of foodborne illness one day at a time. I'm missing some ketchup. Lots of pickles. So we really haven't seen our server much. We've had not the best service. We we're laughing because we had better wings and better service at the ball game. Which is which is kind of yeah. Anyway, food's not bad. Burgers were good. The wings came out very, very overcooked. Um, so we got some more sauce for them and it's making them better. But yeah, I mean hey. I'm not necessarily complaining, but being very objective. I don't know about this location. When in Buffalo, you just gotta drink the sauce. Sure. <laughs> now my sodium levels are over 5,000 for the day. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. So anyway, that was the anger bar. Not the best experience, but you know, it is what it is. So. Here's some cars, because the cars are pretty damn cool. These cars are brand new, I tell you. you